All right, so when does an asset become a liability? This is something you might not even think is possible, but I want you to consider this. There's two times, two times an asset becomes a liability. Number one is when it costs you more than it produces, or it costs you more than it could produce. And here's what I mean by that. You put money in the bank. That's an asset on your balance sheet. You're like, oh, I've got cash. Okay, well, the bank's paying you 0.10%. Inflation's nine. That's not an asset. That's a liability. That's costing you money from the standpoint of it doesn't produce enough. The other thing is, what could it be producing? What if you had that money invested in seller finance real estate, making you 12 or 13 percent like sure it's in the bank sure it's earning something but it's not earning what it could earn and so that's inefficient the second time that an asset becomes a liability is when it costs you time itself i buy a rental property and i'm like great i'm making 500 bucks a month in cash flow but i spend 10 hours a week managing it i now have a job my 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 500 a month if i divide that out i'm being paid like 12 an hour that's not good that's not a good thing that's not an investment so it's costing me now it's a liability